China launches a trade war against Russia after Russian naval drills with ASEAN. Russia held a massive naval exercise with 10 ASEAN member states this week. So, Russia has just announced its entry into Southeast Asia as a partner of countries that are being victimized by China. The first ever joint naval exercise between Russia and a number of Southeast Asian countries began on Wednesday along the Strait of Malacca, one of the world's busiest maritime channels. The drills took place at a time when tensions in the Indo-Pacific are rising, especially in the South China Sea. Warships and planes were contributed by Indonesia, Thailand, Singapore, Vietnam, Malaysia, Myanmar, and Brunei, with the Philippines serving as a virtual observer. This is the first-ever naval exercise that Russia has held with ASEAN member states. So, China is miffed. How dare Russia flex its naval might in Southeast Asia, which Beijing is trying to swallow whole? To get back at Russia, China has begun an even more intense trade war against Moscow. According to Russian Consul General in Harbin Vladimir Oskepkov, Chinese authorities have introduced new restrictions on the import of certain categories of goods from Russia. China has stopped importing certain goods from Russia via some railway crossings, including coal, iron ore, fertilizers, pulp, or in agricultural produce. The Russian diplomat said, the actually introduced ban covered plenty of positions of Russian import in China, except wood. He added, on December 1, similar restrictive measures were introduced at another railway crossing point of Zabaikalsk Manshuli. They apply to lumber resources from Russia also, with containerized cargo being an exception. Interestingly, the ban on imports was put on the same day when the naval exercise between Russia and Southeast Asian nations took off.